this was not in the book, but I heard you say in an interview that that you were upset with Nikki and Tommy because when you texted them about the issue with your son, where he, your son was having some drug issues, you texted them because they're Motley Crue, they know about drugs, they went through that stuff, and they did not respond. Do you think, and that upset you, do you think, though, that maybe... I mean, I don't know what it's like to be in Motley Crue. Like, how many texts, phone calls, emails, and things do they get? I mean, do you think they just didn't even see it, or they just got bombarded and forgot about it? No, no, it doesn't matter to me. Um, the bottom line of it is, um, um, now, now, look, at the end of the day, Tommy and I are fine. Tommy still texts me. Mm -hmm. it text, he, we contact each other on Instagram, but I didn't do anything until Tommy reached out to me first and, uh, you know, and said, Hey crab, how you been? Blah, 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 whatever. Or there, I posted something and he made a comment about it. And then I, and then I reached out. I, I wasn't mad at them. I was a little disappointed in the fact that if you want to be upset with me, awesome. I, you know, say la vie but you watched my kid grow up um i reached out to them i did not ask them for money i did not ask them for anything what i asked them for was hey you guys have dealt with heroin addiction how do i handle this i got nothing from nikki at all no response no nothing and Tommy just wrote back, he just wrote back one word. He just said, it like, wasn't like, oh shit, dude, sorry. Like, fuck, are you kidding me? Ian's taking drugs, you know, blah, blah, nothing. He just wrote rehab. No, like rehab, uh, you know, good luck, Tommy. No, like nothing. He just wrote rehab, Sen. Hmm. And I was just like, man, how like, you know, especially I was, I was a little, bummed out with Tommy because Tommy's the one that got Ian his first drum set. Tommy's the one that Ian looked, the, he looked up to. Um, and I just said, you know what? I have reached out to those guys on multiple occasions. Um, I reached out to Nikki when he divorced Donna D'Errico. Um, I reached out to Tommy when the kid died in his pool. I reached out to Tommy when he went to prison. I reached out to Tommy, you know, and all those guys multiple times, and I never got a response. And, but I, I thought maybe if they realized that there was something wrong with my son, they would just go, hey, dude, here, like, uh, call this counselor. Or, hey, this guy's a really good counselor. Here's mm -hmm. his He can help you figure it out. Um, they didn't respond. Okay, say la vie. I just said, fuck it, whatever. I'm not, I'm done with those guys. I'm, I, I won't ever bother them again. I won't ever call them again. I won't forget it. 